Hey guys, it's Amy Smith from Game On Fitness. We have paper plates today. This is part of our workout. All right, so what if you don't have paper plates at home? First of all, you probably need to look hard. The other option is go to like a hardwood floor type surface, okay? And then grab a pair of socks or a washcloth, maybe even better, and put those underneath your feet for the same gliding experience that I'm gonna have on carpet with paper plates. That being said, do not put anything on that carpet or on that um, towel or sock. Don't put like pledge or anything like that. I don't want you wiping out. I just want you to feel the glide. It's gonna put more work on the stabilizing leg. Okay, it's a killer workout. All right, if you need me to go ahead and grab your stuff, pause the video and come back to me. All right, here we go. I have my paper plates. One of them's going down for now. The other one is going underneath my right foot. All right, we gotta get used to this because Everybody's a little bit different type of carpeting, so you're gonna have to make sure it glides for you. If it doesn't and you don't have a glider, just lift your foot up each time. All right, knees over the ankle. I want you to know I'm gonna be losing my balance a little bit too. Don't be judging me, I'm not judging you. It's about doing our best, right? So let's squeeze our core, roll the shoulders back and down, place your arms in front, we're going out, and in. Come on, seven, and in. Here's six, I'll scoot back a little bit so you can put your here's five, here's four, three, Here's two, now from the lunge to the foot. Got eight, to the foot. Here's seven, it's like a curtsy now. Here's six, to the foot. Here's five, watch this leg from the behind. Four, three, two, back to out and in. Here's eight, in. Now, we're getting our balance though. We can use those arms if we like. Three, good, you got it. I have two more. Now curtsy, got eight, curtsy, seven, curtsy, six, curtsy, here's five, curtsy, here's four, curtsy, here's three, curtsy, here's two, good, no big deal, shake it out a little bit, all right, left leg, if you notice you're going to feel the work on the stabilizing leg, that's where I want it, okay, pull your shoulders back, squeeze the car, arms out in front until we get our balance. Out and in, here we go, nice. Down, here's step, down, here's six. Again, I'm gonna shoot back a little. I don't know where you can see me, but hopefully you can. Got four, three, two, curtsy, here we go. Got eight, and down, here's seven, good. Here's six, five, got four, three, two, Back to that lunge. Up and back. Good. Seven. You got it. Six. Five. Eight. Four more. You got four. Three. Two. You know our one. Back to that curtsy. Get your balance. Got it. Seven. Here we go. Right? Six. Five. I four. Three. Two. Last one. Now we should feel it a little bit. Yes, I am. All right, grab that plate again. Shoulders back, belly button in. Think about wearing a really, really tight swimsuit, okay? One piece. So I walk by you. How's that stomach feel? Tight, controlled, okay? Right leg to the side. Stomach in. Seven. Now notice I'm using my arms. Six. Five. Good. Four. Three. Now maybe you're wondering, why is my heart rate coming up on this? Okay, we're going down and up. Anytime you have down and up, that heart rate's gonna go with it. You got it, so get low, get high. Get low, get high. Three, get high. Two, great, good job. Recover. Can you hear me hopping and popping? I'm just in. All right. Shoulders back, belly button in, to the side. Five, eight, in, seven, good. Six. Now, a couple things. Notice my right knee, sing over the ankle, not the toe. Good. You got two. Eight more, you got it. Come on. You got eight. Up. Seven. Up. Six. Up. Five. You got four more. Hang in. You got four. Up. Three. Up. Two. Up. One. Beautiful. Good job. All right, now we're making a little circle with this situation. I think I'm gonna angle. Help me see my foot a little bit better. Take it out, back, in. Again, seven, back, in. Who cares about your arms, right? Six, get the moves first. 
in. Here we go. Five, back, in. Again. Four, back, in. Good. Three, back, in. We got it. There's two. You're losing your balance. Focus on something in the room that's not moving. Okay? Now make it big. Big. Back. Whew, here it is. Sit. Good. Look at his arms. They're going crazy. I don't care. Got four. I need my balance. Three. Two. Back to slow on this leg. Out. Back. In. Good. Seven. Back. In. We got it. Six. Back. In. Come on. Five. Back. In. Hang it. Four. Back. In. Breathe, breathe. Three. Back. In. Two more. Two. Back. In. One more. You know where I'm going now. Big circles. Put it together. Out. And in. You're set. This is where you lose the music you want. You're six. Woo! My left leg's on fire. You're five. You got it. Here's four. If yours is not, get lower. Two. Woo-hoo. Good job. All right, other side. So you can see I switched legs. I keep turning my position so hopefully you can see me a little bit better. All right. So the side first. Out, back, up. Uh, again. Seven, back, up. Good. Six, back, up. Five, back, up. Notice this knee. Four, back, up. Woo, losing that balance. Three, back, up. You got it. Two, back, up. One more. One, back. I need you to put it together. Big circle. Good. Good. You're seven. This is where you might go slower or faster, depending on the carpet, right? There's five. Mine's real tough. It's real tight. Not very flush. Come on, we got two more. I got two. One more. All right, now you're gonna go back to that slow again. Get your balance. Got eight, back, up. If you're new to this, put the right arm on the wall. Right, help with your balance. Six, back, that's okay. No big deal, then try again without it. Four more, hang in. Four, back, come on. Three, back, up. Again, those arms, I don't care. Two, the counterbalance. So whatever helps you, helps me, right? Big circle, here we go. Big circle, again, you use that arm. You wanna go deeper into this leg. This. You're five, otherwise, we're gonna balance. Four, oh, it's lost it. Here's three, two more, two, one more. All right, I'm sweating, are you? I hope so. If not, get lower on your series, okay? I work out almost every day. You should be sweating on these. All right, here's what we're going. I'm going to the floor now, and I'm gonna keep these. All right, so coming down, went from one plate to two. I have one standing by, so it's ready when I am, because I might use that to like add on a little bit, okay? All right, here's where I'm going. I'm gonna take the one plate, put it to the side for the second. Hope you can see my feet on this series. I'm gonna push my core in. Now, you can do this series and modify it. How do you do it and modify it? If you're on all fours, the left foot comes out in like this. Okay, it's a great modified series, it's a bun series. I want you to notice my neutral back. Belly button pulled in and I can shake my head up from side to side. No big deal. By the way, I say no big deal, it's still fantastic for you. And you can always take the opposite arm out. Or arm out, elbow in. I promise you, it is great for your core. Do not worry about keeping up. All right, roll your shoulders back. Of course, you would keep the same count that I'm doing, okay? So everybody, no matter what level you're at, you're gonna try and put that plate underneath the left leg. Shoulders back, belly in. Right foot's your stabilizer, I'm in my plank. Slide in, in and out. In. Out, left leg, step, out, good, six, out, five, out, here's four. All right, so once it's too much on your wrist, you can go to elbows, but bring your booty up a little bit. Now tuck the knee to the opposite elbow, and back, seven, and back, six, and back, five, 
five. Too much in the back, bring your booty up. Four, let's down dog. Three, that's perfectly fine for me. Two, level one, take a child pose. Level two, outside. Outside, in, seven, in, six, in, five, in, I have four, three, two, amazing, good. Child pose, extension needs flexion. Release. Awesome. Now you can just go to the other foot. I'm going to turn around, right? It's like what you can see what's going on in case you forget. All right. Place one side. Level one. You could be here. You could be here. It's up to you. Level two. I am going for the plank. Roll your shoulders back. Belly in. Here we go. Bring it in. Guys. Out. Seven. Out. Here's six. You got it. Five. Here's four. No big deal. Three. Two. I'd say it was first set, right? <laughs> Press it in. Got it. Back. Seven. Back. Six. Back. Come on. Five. Back. Four. Back. Three. Back. You got it. Two. Outside the elbow. Let's go. Eight. Come on. Seven. Five, finish it. Four, three, remind your child pose for my level one. Good. Release. All right. Clearly I did our core. Clearly I did our legs, right? We got our quads in there. I'm not going to forget our arms, even though we have plates and not weights, okay? How do we do it? Same principle, but we're going to be gliding, okay? So here's where we're going to go. I think I'm gonna go this way so you can see my left arm. All right, now my level ones, you can go to modified plank. In fact, let's all go to modified plank. That way you can get the series a little bit deeper into the arm. Don't worry, I got your core in a million different ways today. All right, I'm gonna take that arm out to the side with a push up, squeeze back in. Seven, squeeze back in. Good, one slow, six, back in. What if this is too hard? Five, right here. I want you to notice my booty is not here. Two more. Two. Last one. Good. All right, child's pose, release the back. Now, how do you know if you're in a proper modified plank? You can come down, bring your feet up, kind of like you're hanging out watching TV. Take your hand off the plate for a second. Exhale, breathe, push it up. Okay, notice I'm not on kneecaps, then I'm set. All right, left arm forward. Right arm is gonna bend. Seven, six, five, four more, hang in. Four, woo, three, two more, two. Heck yeah, child pose. All right, other side. Those are a lot harder than they look, am I right? Okay, again, let's get set easy. Come down. Kind of like you're hanging out watching TV. Feet are up. Exhale. Bring the hips up. Bring the hand up. All right. Does that make sense? I hope so. Now we're on the other side. Here we go. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. You can go slower than me. Who cares? Four. Three. Two. Last one. Good. Child pose. Ladies and gentlemen, I hate sweating. I hope you are too. Okay. Again, hanging out, watching a little TV, bringing the hips up. And here we go. Good. Send that left arm. Seven. Six. Five. Come on. Four. Three. Two. Did you do it? Better yet, I know you did. Good job, child pose. All right, shake it out a little. As a reminder, when you're doing those arms, it's about how far you can go without bringing your back up and without it going into your knees or lower back at all, okay? So if you're going inch or two, it's totally fine. Your arms are activated. I know your core is activated. Hello, look at me, it's funny. Okay, I'm activated. All right, here's where we're going next. We got a series, we need both, okay? For a series with two. This is a little bit of a level two, level three move. 
So I don't want you to peace out if you're a level one. I want you to try with one plate on one foot, round two, one plate on the other foot. So I'll do two rounds of eight that we can join in. And more importantly, my level twos, right? Two rounds of eight. You got it. All right, here's where we're going. We're gonna crush this out for final burner. Okay. Again, you can go to modified plank if you feel it in your wrist. You can go to the elbow. That makes sense, okay, but I still need your leg extended, or you can do one leg at a time. So what I want you to do, stretch your heart with more, look how carefully I'm getting in. Okay, so I pick up my toes, put the plates underneath. Now, this is a great time to do a little cat and cow, release your back before you get started in. All right, and I did promise two rounds of eight, okay? All right, we're going to full plank, mountain climbers. Here we go. Got eight, eight, seven, seven, six, So if you're a level one, put that plate on the other foot now. All right. Level two, get another round. Here we go. Got eight, eight, seven, seven, six, six, five, five, four. Come on. Four, three, three, two, two, one. Heck yeah. Child pose. All right, let's stretch it out a little bit. All right. Bring one leg in, spinal twist. All right, so what if you're just getting warmed up and you want to do a little bit more? Got some options for you. Number one, any of these YouTube series that I'm doing, you can double or even triple up. So you know the series, it's almost like you're a master now, okay? So you go back to the beginning of the video and do the whole thing again. It's almost like you can predict what I'm saying, right? Okay? Another option, gameonfitness.org. We have our GoFit videos. And for a limited time, they are free. So download or pull up one of our videos and do a little workout with us. You can work out with me as well as, as, well as with my other trainers. Okay, that toe. All right, now sometimes when I do that series, I feel my hip flexors. So I'm gonna place my feet, so my hands on my feet, kind of press out a little bit, release them. Okay. Take the right leg in front, wherever it's comfortable for you. Left leg here. Nice deep breath, walk your hands forward, release the head. Exhale, bring it up. If you choose to grab the leg, you may. This means I have no knee issues, by the way. Give knee issues, just a little pressure there, okay? Exhale, switch. Okay. And we're gonna bring it down. Bring it up. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you had fun. I hope you got a little workout in, and I hope you sweat a little bit with me. Game on.